created a wide range of types of book, from storybook to historical, from biography to travel. I remember one moment my grandmother told my mom that I should spend more time playing outside in order to make me more creative, not just sit and reading a book. Although I like swimming and playing tennis, reading is my most loved activity. When I read, I feel that I have taken into a new world, a world that is full of imagination and full of ideas. My reading experience sparks my imagination, and as we all know, that imagination is a tool of creativity. Reading books helps us to think something, to imagine something that we wouldn't have thought before. Creativity is something that I feel increases in me every time I read a new book. When you read a new book, something on your mind creates a scenery in front of your eyes. And if you read, read, and read again, new books with new start learning and experiencing new things. You understand things better and learn faster. You start thinking something in a different way. Your point of view change, even I can say improves. And with creativity, we can solve everyday problems in more efficient way. We can make life more fun. So, even though I love my grandmother, I have to say that she was totally wrong by saying that reading a book is a resistor to the creativity. On the contrary, reading boosts creativity. One day, my cousin asked about my reading habit, whether I prefer to choose an e-book or a real book. Of course, there are many advantages of having a lot of books that I want to read in my smartphone or in my gadgets. But personally, I like the smell of the book. You know, the smell of the book. Nowadays, we're living in a technological world. With our smartphone in our, our, on, or our gadgets in our hand, we can do more than just taking a phone call. We can order food, we can chat emails, we can listen to the music, we can watch hours of videos, we can take pictures and the list is still long. People forgot the fun side of reading a real book. They download an ebook on their smartphone, but often they cannot finish reading it because of the distraction they get while reading on their smartphone. In some ways, our smartphone engages making us less smart and less creative. It decreases our ability in social skill and relationships. So, I think we need to think of ourselves for a while. Try to forget the smartphone engages. They're not the TV. They're not the computers. Just get a good book. Sit, read, and relax. Enjoy the book in our hand. I hope in the next few years, I can have more friends who love reading like me so we can discuss and share our ideas together from the books we recently read. Remember, it's never too late to start reading and also Reading boosts creativity. Just like Frederick Douglass said, once you read a good, once you learn a, to read a book, you will be forever free. That's all my speech today.